Hey guys, this is Mike Dangris here. So today it's gonna be another Lego Star Wars buildable buildable figure, which is Darth Vader, possibly the most iconic villains in the Star Wars universe. So that's pretty surprising. So yeah. So set number is seven five one one. And see here instruction manual. Just pretty much just has like 42 pages to build, or is it 47 pages to build? So, yeah. And also, add for the other figures because I have General Grievous. If you haven't seen that, my review of this figure, I think you might recommend to see it. Here's another ad for the, the actual Lego sets, and and it's pretty much and uh, pretty much based off the episode 3 sets. So, yeah. So, okay, let's just take a closer look at my, my man Darth Vader. So, yeah. So, yeah. I know Kyle Ren's like he's our boy. Kyle Ren, I think, yeah, our boy. But this Darth Vader is our real boy. It's everybody always know Darth Vader is our boy. Woo! So yeah. So this is pretty much an extremely great looking figure. I actually build it. And also he has like pretty nice looking arm articulation, which is like here, here, here. Yeah. And also this his head is actually pretty nice, and also. It's like pretty smooth, right? I'm just like trying to get that, that trying to move that head for for the first time. We have that pretty little sticky in there. Also, his helmet's like pretty super accurate for some reason. So yeah, yeah. Every Darth Vader figure has that accurate thing. This, this is that the real accurate creation of this. So yeah, black helmet. So yeah. And also, it's a pretty interesting thing if you. Pretty much like looks like he's gonna all these this lightsaber piece and also oh hang on let me get this right let me see let me get this right let me get this right there he goes so yeah pretty much he is like pretty much holding the way with both hands and yeah, it's pretty badass looking nostril. That lightsaber piece looks pretty badass. It's all red and pretty nice to do that. So yeah. So yeah. Also, his legs are pretty quite nice. So yeah. A lot of a lot of exclusive pieces like. His armor, his armor piece, and uh, a sweet looking uh, control fan on him. So, and also, he can, and also, is, a move, is also movable, so yeah, pretty surprising. I think I gotta put it like here to like, didn't show that the whole thing. So, yeah, here it goes. So, yeah, it's pretty, pretty nice too. There it goes. So, yeah. And also, he has like this pretty sweet looking uh, gray thing, so yeah. And also, the first time I finally got, the first time I just like, this cape is very much a well, quilt for some reason, so pretty. So, it wasn't fluffy enough for that quilt. So, yeah, it looks like I'm gonna put this, look like, it's like I gotta put him like a, like a <laughs> it looks like a Darth Vader sauce hot, hot dog or something, but it's a goddamn cape. Yeah, everybody knows it's a freaking cape, not so. Yeah, and also like my only complaints are there's like why is this whole thing is coming from? Is I think I actually put like cover up or something. That's just really nice. And also like, just like take a look at his back. Extremely weird because it looks like all that. Looks like all those uh, carve all those uh technic pieces into one. So yeah, which I noticed in like. Hang on, let me get this. Yeah, yeah, they actually carve all that. Yeah, they actually carve all of that, so that's pretty disturbing if you rip all those pieces from Vader. Which is like the most disturbing thing I've ever seen in my in my entire life. Like, ripping out all those, like, trying to, like, carve all those, uh, Technic pieces, so, yeah. That's pretty much, I think. Yeah. Red, red pig. So, 
use it. So yeah. So yeah, it's really awesome that if you like pretty much just that. Maybe I could like put pretty much put the similar pose as the as a box or a manual because he's like pretty much quite tall than I thought. So yeah. So yeah, that, I think that's I think I need to compare that in the summer art as that. So yeah. So this is probably the best looking uh, bellable figure ever. Because I think the, I think the I think the the ones that didn't have those weird looking human faces like the I don't know if it's a I think the, uh yeah Luke Skywalker and uh Obi Wan yeah they have like two weird like, weird looking faces on them and also the and also the Django Fett and that. One of the stormtrooper ones looks pretty cool looking, but I was the one that wanted that goddamn uh, was it? Ah, oh, I think Jangle Fat is like the best one. I think he looks freaking awesome looking because of the the helmet and uh, sweet looking guns, and that stormtrooper looks pretty freaking awesome looking because it's like he has a cannon for some reason. And also, I just like can't wait to get the Force Awakens uh billable set because those are the ones I need. So yeah. So yeah, pretty much the best looking billable figure because I think I'm gonna put this next to General Grievous because that thing's freaking huge, man. Here's the like the like possibly some viewers, some reviewers actually also mentioned about that. I think one of them is like I think it's like Jane Bricks or something. I think he's like thinking about it looks almost similar to the Witch Doctor's uh, figure from Hero Factor because he's like pretty tall and General Grievous also possibly isn't possibly the tallest man ever. So yeah. So this Star Vader looks freaking awesome looking because he's our boy, even from Kyle Kyle Ren's our boy. But this is our real boy, so yeah, possibly the most popular popular Star Wars villains ever. Yeah, that's what I think. Like I heard a lot of people thinking. So yeah, so yeah, this is possibly my favorite. I think I just like top next to General Grievous for some reason because the uh, the Force Savers and well, this this Star Vader looks a lot freaking awesome looking. So yeah. So yeah guys, so I was hoping I might see you for more videos this week. So yeah. So this is definitely a pretty super quick review of the dark of the Lego Star Wars buildable figure Darth Vader. So yeah, because the, pretty much like a pretty awesome looking uh the accurate helmet, the those pieces, and also that crazy looking carved technic pieces behind him. That's possibly the most disturbing thing ever. Yeah, because of those are technic pieces. So yeah. So this is definitely that. So yeah. So yeah guys, so hope you might see for more videos. So bye for now. Bye for now. Okay, I know people. Um I might gonna review that the Raphael Nick Turtles uh that's which is this one. Bossy around like before I just making the like the classic series and this is the Nick ones. So yeah. And also why I had to okay, put this goddamn thing he looks pretty big for some reason. You know, so I had to like pretty much put that the, the peanuts uh, light brick set back here because I just like pretty much put this to make more room for him and yeah because I need to put somewhere else with goddamn General Grievous because this huge uh, this huge motherfucker is actually pretty much makes room here. Actually, actually maybe maybe look like nice room. Let's see, I can put this goddamn thing. Okay, make pretty. Yeah, that's 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 a that's a good result. Yeah, it look, looks like this. So yeah, I think this is, might have been like too much bigs. Actually, the hoard that hoard everything. So yeah, maybe I could put that the goddamn lemon stand and the peanuts little light brick set. So yeah, so that's a video. So good luck.